Hi everyone, welcome back to a new video. So for this set, I'm going to be using Perfect Blush. This is going to be my base colour from uh, on all of the nails. I'll also be using nails Crystal Clear, but I didn't show you that one. Um, the glitter I'm using today is called Enchanted from Nail Sugar. It's part of the Enchanted Forest collection. It is a stunner. I don't know why I've not used it before. Oh, it's so nice. Um, so the set is going to be... It's a pretty straightforward set, it's, it's pretty simple. I'm literally only going to show you two of the nails that I'm doing because four of them are going to be the same, so you're not going to really need to see the rest of them. Um, so all apart from the ring finger are going to look like this. So I'll be putting down the perfect blush as the base colour. I love this colour. I would have a set of just perfect blush nails. I think it's so nice. Uh, and then uh, the enchanted glitter is going to go at the free edge and I will blend it up the nail. Is it up the nail or down the nail? Up. It's up the nail, isn't it? Um, to create a glitter fade. Simples. There we go. So all the nails are going to be like that apart from the ring finger so for the ring finger we are again going to put the perfect blush down as our base colour I'm not too worried about that glitter that's stuck in the acrylic <laughs> because this nail is going to be a full glitter nail so I'm going to pick the glitter up with a small wet bead of clear acrylic and just I, I literally I tried to pack on as much as I could because I'm oh god I love this glitter it's so nice the more the merrier <laughs> that's going to be my saying about glitter the more the merrier there we go. So the this is, these are the nails done and ready to cap in clear. So I will go ahead and cap them, file and buff them. And then this is what they look like once they're filed and buffed. And I am going to show you now. I'm going to be using water decals. So these are available from Nail Sugar. And they are a really good way of adding detail to nails. If you're... No, well, it, you can... I mean, even if you're... This is warm water... Even if you are good at freehand, these are, they're just a, a quick, convenient way of adding detail to the nails without having to faff around too much yourself, if you see what I mean. Um, in the little packet, you're going to get a sheet of the decals. I've already used one of them. Um, but I'm just going to decide which ones I'm going to use. So I'm going to take one of the, they look like, I don't know if they're, they're actually more like dream catchers. I want to call them mandalas. Um, they're dream catchers, aren't they? So I'm going to put a whole one on the ring finger. And then I'm going to put one of the sort of half ones at the cuticle area on the middle finger. So I'm just going to cut away any sort of excess you know cardboard not cardboard paper um there are a little there's a little plastic film over the top so just pull that off and then you're just going to dip it into the the warm water and they'll be all right in there for about you won't I, I would don't think you need to put them in there for any longer than sort of 30 seconds so while they're in there normally i put water decals over a tacky layer of gel polish but because i've used acrylic what i'm going to do is put a thin layer of base coat over the nails that I want to put the water decals on and then obviously this will create a tacky layer for us so those water decals aren't going to sort of move around a lot check out this glitter though oh so nice oh I love it so I'm going to kill those for 30 seconds actually I think the gel it kills for 60 seconds but I think I only done it for 30 so I'm going to take the decals out of the water so you can see it's already starting to slide off that backing paper. Um, just make sure you dab off any excess water because you don't want... Just make sure it's nice and nice and dabbed. <laughs> do 
dab um and then you can just i just get my tweezers um and take it off that backing paper but it just comes off so easily so this one i'm going to put on the ring finger there we go so that sticks really nicely onto that tacky layer and then I'm going to get the other one again I'm going to dab off the water <coughs> and then you can see that it starts to slide off but it slides off even before I've got my tweezers to it so this is going to go at the cuticle area on this middle finger There we go. So they're not going to go anywhere now. They are going to be stuck on that tacky layer of base coat. So I'm going to use my Nail Come Non Wipe Top Coat now to top coat the nails because it's top coating time. Um, my favourite bit, obviously. Um, so you've got to check out this glitter because it's so nice. And this top coat is so shiny. I love it. Look at that. It's so beautiful. Oh, so nice. Okay, so you're going to see now that the water decals aren't going to go anywhere when I top coat. And we're obviously just sealing the water decal in. So that's not going to go anywhere. There we go, and the last one. So we're going to cure these in the lamp for 30 seconds. Now they're all top coated. They're so pretty. Um, and then I will show you the close up. So this is them all done. So you can see it's just a little bit of detail on a pretty simple set of nails. So I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please leave me a like. If you haven't already, do consider subscribing. And I'll see you tomorrow with a... I, I really like tomorrow's nails. <laughs> see you tomorrow.